Hello everyone, my name is Sinner and we've got something new for you today. However, before we get into the video, I'd like to take a moment to tell you that nearly 70% of people who watch our videos are not subscribed. If you're not subscribed, you could do me a huge favor by liking the video, commenting below, subscribing to the channel, and ringing that bell. It really helps with the channel and lets me know that you're liking what I'm making. Alright, without further ado, let's get into the video. Out of stamina. <laughs> Probably doesn't seem to have much hit points. Is he actually super easy? <laughs> we can probably full moon him. Well, dark moon him. Depending on where the stake put us. We'll see. Ah. Let's take a sip. Hello, Godfrey. Oh, no. Ah. Probably need that, probably need this. Probably kill him. Talisman Pouch. That was the first Elder Lord. Didn't seem all that strong. We got 80,000 runes out of it then. I think with that we have our full build possible to come online. I don't have a build, really, but uh, we are, we have a full version of something. All right, so we need like, what, like four more grand? Like three, eh, three, four. We can equip another pouch now. So let's try a nine. That should do the trick. And level up our Vyga, our Vyga. One of us. And now, it's time for that last talisman. What do we want it to be? This is a good question. We can go with Toidle, so that we heal slightly faster. Go with this. Hey, you know, increases it by about, you know, 15 or so, 13%. Raises focus. We could increase our memory slots. We get with that one. Make ourselves a sneaky boy. Um, vastly increases HP. I mean, if you say so. Okay, so we don't need this because we already get enough. We can't stack these, so that would be funny. We can increase our intelligence if we want to. Or go with Moon of Noxtella. And that lets us memorize more spells. So we're gonna have some non-combats in there. Yeah, two more. I'm sure we'll get more spell slots. Probably, maybe, hopefully, probably not. 
Uh, but this will let us do... Starlight and Sneaky, wherever Sneaky is. There's Sneaky Brigi. That works. That works. Yes. No horse ahead. What is down here? Death? Death. <laughs> so what is over here then? My lot of these dead maidens. Fingus. Fingus. These weird old these weird old ladies are obsessed with fingers. This is holy grease. Lord? Another Lord vessel. So does every Elden Lord need an Elden Lord vessel? Or is that not a thing? That really seemed easier than some of the enemies. Some of the common enemies, actually. Kind of weird. And yes, you can jump to your death. You're into that kind of thing. Luckily, you can enjoy the experience of hitting the ground at Terminal Velocity more than once in Elden Ring. Entirely up to you. Oh, that's water down there. Gotcha. It's water. That makes sense. Alright, what else is over here then? I don't know, how Somber smithing stands. We need some, like, nines, though. Can we open it? No. Alright then. What lies up here? Anything around? No. Yes, you did. Ex work skeleton. No, liar ahead. Didn't expect friends. Balls are always your friends. They love listening to all of your problems. Well, more they can't get away. You know, if you jump down there, something happens. That would be funny is if you can click on this and then it just turns out to be a pit trap. <laughs> Alright. Incantation. Regression alone reveals secrets. Regression alone. Why is it always God? Hmm. Rats. <gasps> A secret. That's what we've all been trying to figure out. Alright, so regression reveals secrets. Sounds close. Are we regressing to the age of the age of lost ancients? Those dudes can't parry, so they're screwed. 
Ah, more Altus Blooms. Consuming Altus Blooms and Miranda is used in making making poisons and such. Let there be bug. Well, it's another one of him. Another one of you boys. Let's take a sip. Consider him now that he takes more damage. No, it's... <laughs> Our next playthrough will be a Dragon Priest, so we'll have to do a lot more actual fighting. Barrier of Gale. Wonder what Barrier of Gale does. No high road ahead. Wrong. There. Alright then. What lies within this within this place? Um right. There's that. Anything over here? Not that we can get to. We could jump over there, but to what end? Can't get back up. We could jump onto that, but again, to what end? It does seem to be a place we can't normally get to. Let's look around first and see if there is a... See if there are... Any... Plates of grace around here that we can use. What is this? First off, trap. Second off, trap. Third off, you're probably already dead or killed it. Fourth off, good job, skeleton. Fifth off, it's just periods, dot, dot, dot. Progression alone reveals secret. Well, I have seen these statues instead of Marika. Do we have to like do something? Maybe a rupture? Perhaps if we pray. Bang. Take the great ring. Yeah, why not? Let's bow. Bring it on, God. <laughs> uh, the series show with a that has a god in it. It's just like, all right, here's the plan. We're gonna go kill God. 
And then the characters encounter like an actual god. They're like, oh. all right, let's kill it. And then <laughs> they just get shotted. That'd be great. Like, what would you expect to happen? It's like, okay, here's the thing. We're going to go step up and we're going to go fight a literal god. The characters show up. They go, you what, mate? The god just sort of looks at them, wills them out of existence. <laughs> they, get, they get Thanos out. You know, it's like... <laughs> okay, so there's a side of grace over there. We might as well just... Go on down. Is this this might be too far to, to fall and survive? Hmm, that's where we came up. So that would be a shortcut to get down, I guess. If we wanted to go down this way. But if we go over here, we could potentially Open this area. Maybe. Oh, here, how's it going, by the way? And, uh, no more characters. <laughs> okay, let's try something else. Why I spare me? Does it just go on forever? Alright. Well, we're not finding anything, so I'm not going to worry too much about it. Let's go jump on this torch and see what uh, see where that takes us. Hey. Curses. Can we get up there? Yes. To no end, though. Okay, well, the only place to go from here... Can't jump over to that, so that's just down. We get on there. We might be able to get somewhere, but most importantly, we can jump from there to there. I think the game is trying to tell us we're not supposed to do that. You have to do a bunch of if you have to do a bunch of stuff, it's probably not the intended path. Oh, shiza. One's facing the other way, so we're coming at this. Goodbye, good sonites. Let's see, what is this? Item. No. Okay. <clears throat> Wait a bow, I could shoot that wall. So, do I have a bow? I think I do. Let's get those. A long bow. I don't want to waste. We don't want to spend those. Error. <laughs> that works. All right. <laughs> Doesn't do anything.
Yeah. Hold up. Yeah. Let's take a sip. Oh no. You don't get some ice. The problem with a huge weapon like that is you want to stay outside. To stay as far away from being indoors as possible. Alright. So we killed these dudes. That seems to be new stuff. So this might have been a form of forward progress and we went into optional content. I see. Right, well, time to go the other way. They're just like, there's been a murder. There's been a murder at midnight. A murder in the dark. Oh, right, right, right. You're stationary. Should just keep vomiting that stuff at us. Mm, three, mm. Damn. Two, three. That'll take care of the problem. Golden ruins. Somber smithing stones. More golden ruins. A partridge in a pear tree. Oh. Right. Secret passage. Oh. We are technically. Ah! It's tonight. Come on, tonight, do a charge. Good night. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna go kill your friend. Thank you. He did it. He showed us. So, you don't have a right, 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 you don't have a right. Be wary of rides. Alright, so we went into here in the wrong order, basically. Hello, Sir Knights! Let's just top up so we can't one shot us. When he turns the corner, we'll pimp slap him with Ronnie's full moon. I guess we won't. Alright, he'll just shoot at us four times. Well, there's tonight. Um, do your special.
Escuche. Well, it's, well, be wary of left more like it. The odds in here? You know, you gotta be sure. Rolling quite. Miranda Pounder. Oh! Okay, let's see. We've looped back around. I like it. That means that we can go check out the rest of this. Oh. Let's see if you want to bypass this place. I understand. We obviously didn't get this way. So let's go grab those fan daggers. Oh no. Take that, you damn dirty knights. So we'll go back down there, murderize all these people. And then go from there. But we did basically go back around into the earlier area of the game. Earlier area of this area. But where is that? Stuff is over there. So I think up here is the fastest, easiest way to get there. I assume if you play a, uh, a hook build with a tower shield, it's super easy here. Reactivate that pool. Yes. Hello, dudes. Weird bull people. Nope. <laughs> we pressed the wrong button at the wrong time. <laughs> <laughs> At precisely the wrong time. But we are very good at quitting out of the game. <laughs> we have been trained well. If you quit out of the game at exactly the right time, by the way, you'll actually get to the lower level. Oh. Like where we are. <laughs> Unintentionally. That means we quit. That means we quit out of the game literally just in time. So our stuff is over this way. They're knights. Die, you bastard. Okay, I don't think there's anything new over there. So... A tree sanctuary. Hmm. 
Okay, let's go over here and we'll get on the roots and try to make our way forward to Rootland. Rootland. <laughs> It'll be fantastic. We'll go over to Rootland and uh, all the rooty things will happen. Go to Root Finland. <laughs> Can we not get on here? This is just window dressing. This is just window dressing. This is death. But what about these other ones? We get on the roots over there. Can you imagine being surrounded by these creepy looking ladies? Obsessed with looking at your fingers all the time. They're worse than that aunt that everyone has that everyone probably has. Oh, let me look at your fingers. Ooh. Ah, the fingers. The entire time you're just weirded out. Okay, so what is up here? I mean, it look... Oh, we got one of those guys. Oh, good. <laughs> I can kill you that way. That's nice. Ah. They are assassins. Visions of love, huh? Let's activate that. What's this? Blessing of the Erd Tree. Can I climb on these? Tabs? I can. So I need to get away from one of those dudes. Oh no. <laughs> so I need to get away from one of those dudes, I can always come up here. Could this be an item? Oh, you know it. It's an item called a tab button. What, what do they have? Things, right? Things. <laughs> there we go. Embrace uh, leaving nonsense messages. <laughs> At least we're not telling people about Fortnite. Confusing, <laughs> confusing non-English speakers. Because all those messages are just machine translated, so it's just like it's just gibberish. All right, so there's nothing over here. We did have that assassin though. That's assassin. There's fighting going on in that, so they're getting invaded. Or something else is happening. Be wary of death. Likely suffer.
Okay, sounds good. Is there anywhere else I can go? I haven't been over there on that on those right on the rampart there. So let's see what it exactly we want to do next. Alright. So let's continue exploring. We got in there and we killed that guy. I'm guessing if we go through here, we go to somewhere else. So let's try going there. Well, I'm not sure. We could just go fight the boss. Uh, let's... How much do I need? Okay, we need like 28 or so. 29 no more. That's a decent amount. How much is this worth? Okay. Oh, this is worth quite a bit. How much is this worth? A lot. Okay. Well, terms can this double. <laughs> nice. Okay, so let's let's use like that. We need two, three thousand more. Maybe a seven. Yeah, that's good. I right, will we'll level up once more, and then we'll go fight the boss. We're just increasing our vigor so that we can take hits. Let's go find out who this is. Who is this person? This monster. All right, who are you? Oh, cutscene. Graceless, tarnished. What is thy business with these thrones? Let's dance then. Ooh. <laughs> much, much more aggressive. <laughs> Is the Omen King then? All right, then Omen King. <laughs> I bet I can parry him to death. Hey. 
part of thinking. <laughs> Let's do this thing. Willful traitors all you say. And perhaps it's time for it to end, don't you think? We got God. <laughs> so instead of using the Dark Moon, perhaps we can have our bestest friend ever come out and help us. Also, we can see how good Stars of Rune are against it. Maybe these will do, do good damage. Also, didn't get this, did, didn't these get buffed? Yeah, it used to cost fifty, now it costs thirty-eight. How much FP do we have? Twelve. Guess we'll see how many times we can we can push it out. Twice. Does pretty good okay damage though. No shockwave or anything? Carry that. But he does. Since he has a long wind up, we can get it pretty easy. We could also try and death beam him, see if that does anything. But these foolish ambitions. To ah! <laughs> We'll try that and see what happens. He'll probably just throw like knives or something at us and knock us out of it. I'll have to get closer though. We can do a good chunk of damage to him though. But if we have our if we have our boy out there. <laughs> Maybe he can help us out. But it does do good damage. You know, it just is it better than spamming out the stars of ruin? Probably not. We're hitting him with a dark moon. When he's busy, you know, after going after our boy. What we wanna do is we wanna save it for when he's going after our going after our dude. What is it doing? Ah. 
Ah. Alright then. I think he's pissed. <laughs> also, since Mende is in a consideration, we could just bash him with Dark Moons, maybe. <clears throat> See how much damage those do. Though we should be using the style. The Scepter, then, right? Oh, the Scepter does more damage now. All right then, we're going to be using the Scepter. Does it change based on... No, it doesn't. It just literally does more damage. All right then. I was thinking it might change based on what sorcery you have equipped. Okay, I think we're outside of that range. That's range. <laughs> we did it. Remembrance of the Omen King. We did it in a really cheesy cheap way. <laughs> but it worked. Now, did we still get his souls or did we not? Did we still get his runes? They and they. We did! Very nice. a very bright flower. Are they very bright because there's like graves under them? What is this bug boss bug here? Okay, so this is the cutscene essentially. We have to move forward. Behold, mana. Time for gesture. No jumping ahead. Why is it always destruction? Farewell, Margit. 
farewell. But we must carry on. Hmm, <laughs> seek fire. Control thorns refuse all. None may enter the earth tree. thing we can do is rest. Hello again, old friend. Allow me a moment to converse with you. You were unable to enter the Erd Tree, no? Prevented by the mantle of barbs. The thorns are impenetrable. A husk of the Erd Tree's being that spurns all that exists without. The only way to stand before the Elden Ring and become the Elden Lord is to pass the thorns. My purpose serves to aid in that very act. So I'd like you to undertake a new journey with me to the Flame of Ruin, far above the clouds, upon the snowy mountain tops of the giants. Then. I can set the Erd Tree aflame and guide you down the path to becoming Elden Lord. The Royal Medallion. A red mark was made on the map. <clears throat> I wish to journey with you once more to the Flame of Ruin, far above the clouds. Upon the snowy mountain tops of the giants, then, and guide you. Very well. We have Shall no. I turn your runes to strength. Let my hand rest upon you. For but a moment, share them with me. Your thoughts, your ambitions, the principles. Very well. Let's do this then. Well, that's what I thought actually. <laughs> so this leads down there. We can't get down there though. It's where we came in. I suppose we could potentially go over here. Divine Breach. I wonder if that is open yet. They unveil the royal capital. <clears throat> Does this work yet? No. How do we get down there as well? So this is the fortified manor first floor. But there was the broken stairs over here. We couldn't get up. We couldn't ascend to the next layer. Yeah, because we wanted to ascend. Right door. Oh, it opens! Okay then. Okay, we can't pull that. Strong foe ahead, there we'll try to walk. There's a strong foe before us. Why is it always in it? Is he gonna like. Take this, you damn dirty. Oh no. Uh oh. 
Then I will bring it. Is that thing just like eat you, essentially? Come get me. I think we got reverse birthed. <laughs> it's like that one scene in Brain Dead, I think. It was Peter one of Peter Jackson's first movies. Uh, that happened somewhere in the movie. And pretty much everybody <laughs> it's just like Ugh. Anyway, go check it out, you'll love it. So, do those stay dead? I don't think so, but we'll find out. They do not stay dead. Have a dual way. Oh no. Previous. No. No intro. No. Could be worse. All right then. We need to make sure we take a step after throwing the moon at it. That's right. Also, the moon does a ton of damage now, so if we could, we want to throw two moons at it. But that's not really going to happen. He throws a new monster. Oh no. Good. It's dead. <clears throat> Magic monstrosity. Okay, well, it will, will course correct. Can it not get it over here? Well, that's unfortunate for it. Please. 